This video is brought to you by Chandana, Malaysia's umbrella body for the cultural and creative economy, connecting creators, regulating bodies, private businesses, policymakers, and consumers, nurturing these entities individually while keeping a collective goal. For more information, do check out the links in the description below. Uh, let's talk a little bit about uh, the people that you work with, because I am still quite unsure whether you audition people. Yeah, I, uh, do you do you audition people first? And if you don't, like, how do you then select the best people to work now, with if you have not worked with them before? Areas, you know, I often have problems with. I hate auditioning, and I don't believe in getting the best people. Yeah. You just learn to accept. In our society, you know, we we, we tend to try, you know, to 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 work with the best. You know, and that's something very capitalistic thinking to try to suit for maximum profit. <laughs> In reality, <laughs> you know, you encounter people from all levels or all walks of life. I think it's the biggest challenge of all is to try to incorporate those differences. And that's so real. And I think this should be a, a, the kind of philosophy that we should be embraced, learn to embrace. It's not trying to get the best image. It's trying to incorporate alternative possibilities through layers of images conveyed through different human beings. So when I work with you, I, I did experience audition before, but I hate experience. You know, I mean, people will get disappointed and some people will say, hey, I'm special because I'm better. I think that's not true, right? Of course, you know, if I if I am uh, directing, if I direct a play, you know, there are only four characters, of course. I can only choose four, right? Often work with a group. Let's say if there are 30 performers coming to you for auditioning, I said, I work with them for three hours. If they don't get a role, it doesn't mean that they lose. At least they gain three hours of experiences. And that's my way, you know, to audition. And also I have to work with them as well. I mean, through different layers. I mean, if... If they don't perform, I mean, they could work with me through design, through sort of a think tank. There are all possibilities in corporate to work with people. Mm, yeah. I'm, I'm not trying to make people happy, but I think we have yeah. to learn to treat the world, you know, in a better way, not by who's better or who's worse. I think everyone's, you know, could contribute to an event if we are willing to work with one another. That's why I often, you know, mix community, art, special specific issues, all kind of things together. They take shapes every day, but somehow, you know, it's almost like writing a book, you know. I mean, the best things about reading is it's not trying to get answers from, from the writer is to try to imagine when a person willing to sit down to contemplate with the experiences therein and transcend that into images through words, phrases, paragraphs, that state of being is fascinating. You know, I try to connect that state of being rather than the material that they're mm. trying to convey through words. Likewise, in theater, when I work with performers, actors, yeah. dancers, musicians. I enjoy watching who they are uh, and how they connect with the self. And that's my first observation. Such honesty would be very, very essential. Mm. So it's, they may not be the best skill-wise, but they could be very inspiring. Uh, <laughs> out of certain rusty, you, mm. rusty way, you know, to use the words or the fingers or whatever, they could be charming too. <laughs> mm.